Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2019 Hyundai Elantra, powered by a 2-liter engine, providing you with excellent fuel efficiency and freshly detailed, so it's looking nice and new. Uh, but let's take a look inside. So first looking in the trunk, which is relatively spacious considering the size of the vehicle, and of course can always be expanded by folding down the rear seats, which can even be uh, done from back here for ease of use, I would say. And now looking in the back seat where you do have seating for three pretty comfortably from the looks of it. And you do have some pull-out cup holders here for your back passengers and hard plastic back seats so you're not going to feel your passengers knees in your back. And now looking in the front where you do have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks. So now sitting in the vehicle with it running, you can see it's sitting at 44,840 kilometers. Moving down to the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your cruise control buttons as well as the controls to cycle through your info screen here where you can look at things such as your digital speedometer, your um, vehicle, or I guess that's your um, cruise control, um, all of your driver settings, let's see, you can also cycle through your drive mode, your fuel economy, your trip information, such as your mileage and uh, fuel economy on said trip for your trip A and B, I would say. And uh, then moving on to the left side of your steering wheel, where you do have your hands-free phone radio controls. And to the left of your steering wheel, where you have your traction control shut off, your lane keeping assist, and your blind spot uh, monitoring, si monitoring system. So... Uh, vehicles coming out of your blind spot will not be a complete surprise to you. Moving on though to your center, your infotainment screen, which is uh, radio, radio auxiliary, USB, and Bluetooth, I believe. Do also have Android Auto, CarPlay, um, and I believe that is it, but that is quite a few options for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. But then shifting into reverse, you do also have a backup camera, so you're going to be able to see where you're going and hopefully avoid hitting anything. But then moving on from that, you have your uh, media controls all right here. Then you have your climate controls, pretty simple, just on three dials. Below that, you have this cubby with a 12 or two 12 volts USB and auxiliary, so you can either plug something into power or charge or just hook up your audio that way. Then you have your main shifter here with select shift down here, so you can manually shift through your gears. You do also have heated front seats with three levels each, so you can customize how warm you want to be as well as a heated steering wheel so you can keep your fingers warm and then your drive mode selector for uh, sport smart which I'd assume is more fuel efficient and normal so that's always nice you can customize your driving a bit and then you have two cup holders parking brake and your center compartment slash armrest here with a uh, pretty sizable storage capacity there and then last but not least you do also have a nice sunroof so you can land the sunshine and uh or let in a breeze if you're going for a cruise but that should cover our look at the interior so now if you're interested feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day